Hey Gun Club Stars, Coach Hernandez here again with another edition of our health lessons. Today's health lesson is going to be on snacks and advertisements that companies use to make you buy their snacks. So the first thing we're going to talk about is what snacks are. What do you think snacks are? Snacks are anything that you eat in between meals and that could be things that give you good energy or things that give you bad energy and we're going to talk a little bit about both now usually when you eat snacks there are two different types of snacks that you can eat whole foods and processed foods whole foods are going to be foods that are not packaged are natural that come from the earth and that you can eat and they'll give you a lot of nutrients. So for instance, when you have a piece of fruit, like this apple, all right, this apple is a whole food. Any other type of fruit will be a whole food, unless it's frozen. But even frozen fruits give you a lot of nutrients and they can be really, really good snacks. Now, processed foods are foods that come in packages and they're, they have extra ingredients added to them. And usually the ingredient that they add the most to processed snacks is salt. So for instance, we have a bag of chips. Now, these, these chips were once a go food. The potato in these chips was once a go food. But once they added salt, they fried the chips, then it became a wo food. So this is an example of a packaged and processed snack. Some other examples of good snacks for you are water. Any type of water bottled or just regular tap water is something that you can drink at any time during the day, in between meals and during meals. So this is a good choice that you can make. Another good choice that is processed is yogurt. This is a processed food, however, it does have a lot of the good nutrients that you need. So this is something that you can have that would be good for you that is processed. Other things that fall into the process category are things like beef jerky. I love this type of beef jerky. There is some added salt, but it also can give you some good nutrients. So this would probably fall in the slow category, not completely in the woe category. So you can eat this, all right? Not all the time, but occasionally. And the last thing I'll show you is Gatorades, fruit drinks, soft drinks, sodas. These type of drinks are not necessarily healthy for you. Can you drink them after exercise? Yes, to replenish the energy that you lost. However, if you're not being active and you just drink this as is, it's not always the healthiest choice. I would choose water. Now, Moving on into the four different types of advertisements that companies use to buy, help make you buy their snacks are the first are they appeal to your health. They're going to make their product sound like the healthiest product out there, that if you eat their product, you're going to be healthy. The second type of advertisement is called bandwagon advertisement. Bandwagon advertisement is when the company makes it seem as though everybody is buying their product except for you. So it's going to make you want to go out to, and buy their product so that you can be like everybody else. The third way that they advertise to you is by using a testimonial advertisement. They'll use superstar athletes, they'll use movie stars, they'll use singers, rappers, anybody that they can find as a celebrity to say that they use their product so that you can want to use their product as well. And the last form of advertisement is called exaggeration. They'll say things like, it's the most delicious, it's the best in the world, it is amazing. Those are words that they use to make you want to buy their product. So that is our catch lesson for today. Hopefully you make some more healthy choices when you're eating snacks. And we will see you guys next time. See ya. Bye.